Hi, and welcome to Interactive Tutorial. In this video, I'm going to show you how to create then and now. This quiz is perfect for creating frame comparisons. You can create your own then and now or before and after stories. Compare city streets today and 100 years ago or show a famous actor in his youth and now. First of all, sign into your profile on interactive.me to start. To create then now, click template gallery button at the top of the screen. Select then now. The preview button will allow you to preview the template. Select the template you like from the list. I'm going to choose this one. Let's click Edit. You can switch between the pictures by using this tool in the middle of your screen. You can add a text above the image if needed. To do this, click on Add Text button under Images. I want to move up my text, so I click on this button. Let's change the text to New York, then and now. I will also change the font size make it bold and move it to the center perfect it's time to add new images to our quiz to do this click anywhere in the workspace you will see a settings block. To add a left image, click Change button under Left Image Sign. There are two ways to upload a new image, directly from your computer or using the Unsplash library. My library section means images you previously used in other projects. They can be uploaded from Unsplash or from your computer. To add an image from your device, click Upload Media. Unsplash library is direct access to the Unsplash stock photo service. We're going to use this option. Let's enter a subject into the search. In my case, it will be Old New York. Select the image you like. I'm gonna choose this old picture of Brooklyn Bridge. Check this box and click Place Image. It's done. Let's try to find a similar picture. I click Change under the right image sign. Choose Unsplash library. This time I'm going with Brooklyn Bridge and start searching. OK, I choose this one. Check this box and click Place image. So, it works pretty well. You can prepare pictures for your project in advance to get a better result. Click the preview and evaluate the current state of your project. Try your quiz and don't forget to rate how it looks on different devices. To do this, switch between the phone and personal computer icons. If you notice an error or decided to fix anything, Return to the editor by selecting this menu item. Don't forget to select title for your project. This will make it easier to find it. Let's name our quiz as Then Now. After that, you can safely click the Publish button. Your project is ready. You can share with your friends by sending a link or choosing any other convenient way. Let's view our project.
This project was easy way to show you how the mechanic works. This is just an example and you can create way more difficult projects. Keep in mind that you can always return to editing your template again by clicking the edit button in my projects tab. You can also check statistics by clicking this button. Good luck!